thanks a lot. Well, somebody decided you needed ethics. I don't know what it means. I don't want to create any problems, but uh, well, uh, I'll, I'll be obliged to to talk about that. And uh, my my agenda tonight is is this. So we'll start with uh, some presentation of what is business ethics, and then we'll see the task, the specific task how it's operating. And we'll do this guy with whether or not there was a failure of business ethics, and which I know it's a strong word, but uh, that's what I'm going to try to present, and end on this last and more important one, how to be ethical. So I'll, I'll, I'll proceed uh, briefly on this and uh, leave some time for questions if, if you want at the end. So what is business ethics? Let me start with one of the now references, one of the classic references of business ethics, this gentleman, uh, which Robert de George, that said that at least business ethics is three things. The first one is uh, academic writings and meetings and in development of the field of academic teaching, research and publication. So it is a, it's a university, university scientific field. The second one is uh, business scandals and more broadly what it can be ethics in business. So the question of managing ethically a company and the last is a movement within business or the movement to explicitly build ethics into the structures of corporations in the form of ethic rules, codes, ethic officers, committees, training, etc. So we can say there are the three things here. The first one is what we call academic business ethics, to be evaluated scientifically. The second one is behavioral business ethics, to be evaluated ethically. And the last is structural business ethics to be evaluated managerially, so as a success in business. We can say briefly that this talk belongs to the first part, the theme of this talk belongs to the second part, and the third one is what we can call the industry of ethics. So there are lots of firms today and companies and, and, and parts of companies that deal with this thing in ethics. But we have to say that there is a great success. Corporate social responsibility. This, this is a, an article from The Economist that it's, well, it's some time ago in 2008, but it said this industry, he's talking about the third one, the third meaning, is in rude health. Company after company has been shaken into adopting a corporate social responsibility <coughs> policy, and it is almost unthinkable today for a big corp corporation to be without one. So everybody has to have it. It's kind of mandatory for companies. There was a big evolution, taking from another article from the same, uh, same magazine. The first course in business ethics was offered in Harvard Business School back in 1915. It is only since the mid-80s that business schools have truly taken